Hi, this is Dr. Fast here. Now, about a month ago, I was shopping around for a new cordless 12 volt lithium ion screwdriver. So, let me explain why I was looking for a 12 volt tool instead of an 18 volt tool. Over here on the right, I have a cordless drill driver. This is 18 volt uh, lithium ion, and this one here by Craftsman is 12 volt. And I can tell you for the type of work that I do around the home, my go to cordless tool is this Craftsman right here. And you can probably tell by the wear and tear on this tool, I use it a lot. And I've had this for probably 10 plus years, and it still works. It works very well. So if you watch any of my install videos, uh, you'll notice that I use this tool a lot. And I don't use the Ryobi 18 volt too much. I only use this if I need to drill through thick metals, or let's say if I'm working on a wood project such as a cabinet, or building a bench, then I would bring out this one right here. Otherwise, I would say 70% of the time, this is my go-to drill driver tool. You also notice the size of this 12 volt tool is much more smaller than the 18 volt. And because it's smaller, if I do installs inside a vehicle, this tool is much more handy than the bigger one. Now, having said that, this tool is getting old. Also, I only have one battery for this. So if I'm working on a project, and this battery dies, it's a real inconvenience. So this is why I was shopping for another 12 volt cordless tool. So while I was looking online, I came across this one here on GearBest.com and I wasn't looking at spending a lot of money. So this one seemed to have all the features I need. Now this one is made by a company called Power Action, which I'm sure many of you have not heard of. I have not heard of it, but the price was pretty decent. So I thought I'd give it a try. So let me open this up and I'll show you what the tool looks like. This kit comes with two 12 volt 1500 milliamp hour lithium ion rechargeable batteries. Here is the AC charger. Now to charge the batteries, what you want to do is take this connector and then plug it into the top connector of the battery like this. On the charger, there is a LED. When it's charging, it'll be red. When it's fully charged, it'll be green. Here's a power action cordless electric drill driver. The model number of this tool is CD6262. To install the battery, just plug it into the bottom here. Let's take a closer look at this tool. The red part on this housing is hard plastic. The black part is a rubbery material, so when you grip this, it's very comfortable. The trigger is a variable speed trigger, so you can control the speed. Over here is the forward and reverse button, so if I push this in, it'll go the other direction. If I push it into the middle, then it'll lock it in place. So if let's say you put this in your tool bag, you can't accidentally push this trigger and drain the battery. At the top here, we have a speed selector. So this is right now on low, there's an L. If I push it this way, it's high, so that's high speed. Low. At the front, we have a 3 8 inch keyless chuck this dial that you see right here is the clutch so if you don't want to over tighten a screw you can adjust the clutch right here and if you're drilling something you want to turn it all the way to this position where there's a symbol for a drill bit at the bottom here, we also have a white LED, so illuminate the area that you're working in. If you want to install a bit, it's very simple. Place it in here. Tighten this. I have a piece of wood here. If I want to put some screws through it, it's not a problem.
let's say if I want to drill some holes through this half inch MDF, it's not a problem. Here I have a piece of metal. Let me clamp this down. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching the review of this Power Action CD6262 cordless electric drill driver. For myself, I know I'll get a lot of good use out of it, just like the older Craftsman that I've had for over 10 years. I do like the overall design of this tool. It's very compact. It's well balanced in your hand. Now, keep in mind, this tool is great for doing car installations or some basic repair in your home. It's not meant to outperform an 18-volt drill driver. And with any tools, there are limits to what it can do. So keep that in mind. Now, as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, I got this on GearBest.com. I paid around $50 for this tool, which is a very good deal considering this kit includes two lithium-ion rechargeable batteries. Now, there are 12-volt drill drivers on the market that you can get for about $60 to $80, but those don't include any batteries or charger. If you're interested, I will put the link in the description below. If you have any questions or comments, leave one in the comment section and don't forget to click on thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.